Alright, so here we have the No 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 team, the No Mythic, No Legendary, No Dawnbringer team for the class event of Diabolist. Just doing the free battles, getting our free gems. Uh, Diabolist, not one of the best classes in the game, probably in the bottom. It does have Fireblade and Firestorm, but there's like Slayer and Sunspear and other things that you would do first before Diabolist. The best part about it is the, the weapon... Fiend Fire, don't buy it in the shop, but uh, you can get it for free just by equipping Diabolist and winning 250 victories. So if you don't have it, then you just need to go get it. Uh, so we're, we're doing Fiend Fire, Vin Barak, 62 damage to all enemies. There's a 75% chance to disease all enemies. Uh, Fiend Fire deals damage to all enemies, boosted by Daemon allies, then curse and burn all enemies. So if you, if you have Diabolist with the Fireblade, then that would be awesome. You cast this, then you got uh, everybody's burnt, and you do do the uh, Fireblade. Got Lamash to convert yellow to purple, deal damage to the weakest enemy. It starts empowered, so it's going to deal damage and convert yellow to purple. We need purple for our Fiendfire and Vinbarak. And then we have our Herald of Damnation, 12 red, brown, convert blue gems to purple, curse and burn the strongest enemy, start battles with full mana. It's a little bit of a bougie no-no-no team, because they're all epic, and they all need to be fully traded. But I'm still within the uh, constraints, the, the, you know, I'm still within the no-no-no um, rules. So, Herald of Damnation. Anyway, Fiend Fire, Vinbarak, Lamash 2, Herald of Damnation, uh, Diabolist or Doomsayer, double purple blue minus green. Let's go. This is the no, no, no for Diabolist class event. At least I hope so and think so, because I haven't used it yet, but we did use a similar team in the world event, so we know that it, it'll it work. All right, we're looking for our converts here, so we got to convert right here. I don't think I have an explosion, so I could probably take this. Um, and now that we got this too, so really big convert right off Jump Street. Blue to purple. Fiend Fire. They're all dead. I'm using Double Nisha Anu. And I just wipe the enemy out. And we're pretty, we're further along. We're not like right in the beginning either. We got the first two going for the third. Uh, I had to start the no, no, no a little early so I could, I'm trying to make this into a clip for later today. Uh, let's see here. So we got, uh, got to remember, it's yellow to purple and blue to purple. So we got that right here once again. Perfect. Oh, he survived, but he burned to death. So, cool. And we would just clean up with Vinbarak if we needed to. No big deal if you don't one-shot. Um, here we go again. Man, this thing is just showing off to you guys. It's showing off. It's showing its butt. Uh, but we want to take that extra turn, and then I almost want to get Venbrack up just in case. So let's do that first. Maybe. Actually, we got Lamashtu to clean up. Eh, let's just play it safe. And it burned to death again. Nice. This uh, no, no, no is really showing off. All right, so we're in to where we got the first three rewards. We're going for the fourth. You need to get a Val Raven here. I usually go with the three middle battles. I don't think it matters, but just a uh, superstition, conspiracy theory. Harold again, dude. We're getting so lucky. Look at that. Boom. As soon as they're done, as soon as they're done, they might get a loyal mount, though. Yep. They got that summon. There's nothing you can do about that unless you're going to stun them. Uh, well, Mash 2 might kill them, but definitely will now. There we go. Remember to subscribe. We're trying to get to 5K. If we get to 5K by October 16th, I will do the longest live stream ever and let you pick the game. So subscribe now, or tell people to subscribe. Everybody can help. We got Harold again. I think it's that blue storm, man. It's really doing work. I don't care about that green. We don't use green. 
Um, we got Venberak, we got Lamash too. We might as well just cast this, right? Maybe I should have waited so I could use the purple. Getting all this mana. Um, Fiendfire. Venberak. Bang. This is like better than the other team I was using. That's not, That happens a lot, though. Like my no, no, no. You don't always have to use mythics. You don't always have to force in legendaries and mythics into your team. You don't always have to. Just because you have a mythic and it's and it's within the restriction doesn't mean you have to use it. Look, we got Harold again. Every single battle. is really good so far uh i would probably use this instead of the other one that we did earlier nice going swimmingly all right we got enough now let's finish this a no 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 all righty do we got harold finally missed on it no it's right here we're getting it every single time it's amazing I could even take this blue for Venbarak and then do it. Nice. Now we got them both again. So we're just going to cast them both. I'll take this red just for some gold. I should have took the upper red first. That was a mistake, but I'm, I'm going to win either way, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, Fiend Fire. And Venbarak. Get out of Dodge. Finish him. Finish him. Yeah, we got Arena tomorrow, guys. So if we make it there, the train has to get out of the station and on the tracks with enough gas. But uh, if we make it there, we will do the Arena tomorrow on live. And you guys can pick the worst team for me to try to win with. We got it every single time. That's amazing. We got Herald of Damnation every single time. Um, yeah, let's do it first. So we can use the red right back into Herald. Oh, Harry. Oh, Harry. And then, um, Fiend Fire, right? Take this blue just from some gold. Um, and Venberak. And yeah, that's it. Nice. So I'm out of sigils. We get our reward. Collect. 25 gems, 10,000 gold, 50 Diabolist experience. And that's where I would stop today. I didn't buy anything in the shop. If I was going for Zulgoth or something, of course, I'd probably buy the first two and uh, make sure I get all rewards here, all the way up to the Chaos Orb. Because when you're going for Zul'Goth, you're going every single orb, you got to chase it. And you may even think about going for the leaderboard to get, you know, if you can get first place, you get a power orb. And that's a lot towards Zul'Goth. If not, hey, you can get some more good stuff. And, one, and class event is probably the best time. If you're ever going to try for a leaderboard... I would say class event, a sneaky little do Diabolist, like a sneaky bad class. Just all of a sudden throw a bunch of gems at it and go for the leaderboard. You could probably get it. I did it with Slayer and I got like, I don't know, I think I was like 50th or 40th or something. Nothing crazy, but anyway, 